priesthood leaders. Joseph Smith had an important meeting in Kirtland, Ohio. He asked the men of Zion's camp to come. Joseph told the men Jesus wanted 12 apostles to help lead his church. The Lord had told Oliver Cowdery, David Whitmer, and Martin Harris to choose the apostles. At the meeting, Oliver, David, and Martin were blessed by the first presidency of the church. Then they prayed together. They chose 12 good men. The men were ordained. They were the 12 apostles. Apostles are very important men in the church. They know that Jesus is our Savior. They teach the gospel all over the world. After a few days, other men were chosen to be leaders in the church. They were called the First Quorum of Seventy. The First Quorum of Seventy helped the apostles. They are the leaders of the missionary work in the church. One day, the 12 apostles were in a meeting. They were getting ready to go on missions. They were trying to be righteous. They wanted Heavenly Father's help. The apostles asked Joseph Smith to pray for a revelation to help them on their missions. Jesus gave Joseph and the apostles a great revelation. He told them about the priesthood. The priesthood is the power of God. It is the greatest power on earth. God gives the priesthood to righteous men. The men use the priesthood to do God's work. There are two priesthoods in the church. One is the Melchizedek priesthood. The church leaders have the Melchizedek priesthood. The leaders are the president of the church and his counselors, the 12 apostles, and the first quorum of 70. The president of the church is the prophet of God. He tells people what Jesus wants them to do. The prophet has men who help him. They are his counselors. The prophet and his counselors are the first presidency of the church. Other men in the church have the Melchizedek priesthood. They're called high priests, seventies, and elders. High priests can be patriarchs, stake presidents, high counselors, and bishops. Some men are chosen to be seventies. They teach the gospel in the wards and stakes. Other men are chosen to be elders. Elders go on missions. All men who have the Melchizedek priesthood can bless people. They can give people the Holy Ghost. The other priesthood is the Aaronic priesthood. Priests, teachers, and deacons have the Aaronic priesthood. Priests can baptize people. They bless the sacrament. They help the elders. Teachers help get the sacrament ready. They go home teaching. They help members of the church live good lives. Deacons pass the sacrament. They help the bishop. They collect fast offerings. Jesus said all men who have the priesthood should learn what God wants them to do. They must work hard. Then Heavenly Father will bless them. 